Okay, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. We're up to episode nine, and it has been less than 12 hours since I started doing this series, and we're up to episode nine. So, yes, um, no, not less than, less than 24 hours since I started doing this, because I slept. I had slept, and then I did this, and that's basically been the last 24 hours. So, yeah. So, what are we doing? We're aiming for the third floor. That's what we're aiming for. And then we're going to refactor half our base to work on the third floor. We're currently running through these four tasks, uh, 13, 14, 15, 16, these four tasks um, simultaneously. And that'll give us enough research points to get the fourth floor, the third floor. Um, in terms of what our main base is, we got milestone two and milestone three working up here. Um, they're both sharing the same train as it goes down and Yes, milestone one is down here and it's just on its own train. So yes, in case you um, are a little bit confused, there are no space belts and there are no space pipes on this entire map. Everything is done via trains. It is beautiful, it is fantastic. So you can see we've got a little train directly loading on here. This is how we do the painting. We offload it, we offload the shape, we paint it on a platform, then load it directly onto a train. Shape stacking is done like this. This one's not currently in use, but it will be in use soon. Anyway, um, so if you're completely new, yeah, that's how we're doing it, everything. And all the deliveries into the vortex are done via train jumping. So we pushed ahead and we got this research nice and early. So this one is this shape, which we've already finished. We've got to update this shape. Okay, let's go ahead and update this one. Uh, We've got to update both these two. This one is probably the more complicated one. This one is this one is just stacking and then you change the colors. You flip the colors at the end. This one looks a little bit more complicated. I don't know about this one. Uh, I'm going to have a look at this one. We're doing this one over here, right? So we've got this shape and then we've got this one over here. Did I already set up for this one? I kind of did. Yeah, this one we can actually set up quite easily because this one, uh, we're coloring this red, but it's the, currently the two circles and the transition was coming from the two circles to having the full shape here. So all we need to do is that, I think. Do we need to do any rotation? We do need to do rotation. We need to do... Uh, right degree rotation uh, and then we send this over and we line this up a little bit nicer so now we're sending the full shape over slightly rotated we color it red up here so clear that out and then we get rid of this we get rid of all these stacks probably didn't need to get rid of this one but yeah yeah, definitely need to get rid of this one though. And definitely need to get rid of that. Okay, that should be good. That should be that shape done then. We don't think we need to do anything else for this one. Uh, let's have a look and see how much crap is in here. Not a lot. We'll clear it out anyway, just to be on the safe side. And there shouldn't be any more crap down here because this is actually sending it off into the big bin. You are done. You're actually only one thing away. I might leave you because you're only one thing away. This one's two things away. So we definitely want to... And this one's so far... This one's really far ahead. This one was really easy. So let's... I want to try and get them all done at the same time. Approximately. So we'll leave this one to last. Okay, you. You need to be done. I would love it. Three circles and a W. The circles, I don't think the circles are the most common thing, but they're definitely more common than W. So I don't think it would be out of the quick. No, that's close. That's very close. Two circles and two Ws. I feel like a three circles and one W should be more common because the Ws are technically like the least common shape. Uh, the least common quarter on the entire map. I'm not seeing one though. We've definitely proven in the past, well I'm not sure if we've proven it, but it definitely feels like in the past 
spending a couple of minutes searching for a shape uh, tends to be better, better time spent. Well, this is my shape, then um, building it from scratch or building it from two different. Look at that, there's another one over there. So there's one here and there's one over there. That's incredible. Okay, do we need to rotate you? We need to rotate you a little bit. Uh, rotate you to the left. I've messed up the rotation before and then had to go back and fix it. So let's just double check. Yeah, that's beautiful. All right, let's get a color, train fluid. For once we're in the correct orientation. And then this one uh, goes down there. I'll knock this one off. Oh, it's our first 10K of the third milestone shape. So yeah, one, this is why I try and, not necessarily for the first couple, but for the final one, you should always set it up as you're intending to do it for um, the rest of the game, for the infinite build. Okay, so how does this one go in? This is, this is going on top of the green one. So this is all the way in here. And this is just going smack dab on top of the green one. So, yeah. We just want to stack it. Uh, stack it. Again, the bottom one is always on the side of the locomotive. So that's, uh, that's beautiful. Oh. And then this. Okay. So, assuming that this one didn't change in any other way. I don't think it did. There, that's like that. Uh, let's have a look. That, that, and then that. So you can see it's got a circle W in all three. If we have a look. Circle W, circle W. It looks the same. The bottom three layers look the same. And then we got... Oh, crap. What did I do? What did I do? Cancel that. We sent it to the wrong bloody thing. We sent it to the wrong bloody thing. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, we sent it to the wrong bloody thing. Uh, we actually need to send it up over here. Okay, so it's almost... It's almost correct. Well, I was, I was too excited to get that other shape done that I sent it off the wrong bloody thing. Uh, okay, yeah. So we'll get rid of this belt. Uh, you have some, you have the red thing on top of you, which is not what we want. So you are what we actually need to stack it onto. Okay. So that needs to be the bottom. That needs to be there. That needs to be there. Okay. Now we're good. So this, yep, is going to be there. And then this one, just to double check, circle with a single W down the bottom left. Circle with a single W down the bottom left. And I'm actually going to, that's quite a long track, so I'm going to double stack these trains. Uh, okay, that one's done. This one, oh god, this is the bane of my existence. You should have been producing stuff by now. What is wrong with you? Okay, top right, bottom left, being stacked. That is a perfectly good shape right there. That is an absolutely, look how, I'm just going to keep zooming in until it works. That's a proper shape. So it's obviously just been taking ages to get its, uh, get its crap together. But it is working. And now this belt just has to go all the way over there. And then please tell me this, this train is lined up correctly. I actually want to see a train go in for this one. Let's respawn the train. That'll be 540. 540 going through there. So we're just going to keep an eye on that. And yeah, if this doesn't tick up, because none of these are ticked up at the moment. This one should be ticked up. This this one should be ticking up. They do take a while though. 
I'm pretty happy with this one. Yeah, these, these belt distances do make a difference. Okay, that's the correct shape. The train is going to send it down here. We've already got some here. Okay, so we're just waiting for trains to deliver this to the next section. So that one's good. That one we just set up. That one's good. Um, I mean, I've got nothing else to do, so I might as well do this one. We could start working on the next milestone, but nuts to that. I want my research. I want my research. Let's have a look for this shape. Two squares, two Ws. That would be nice if we could just find that out in the wild. Then uh, again, two Ws is a little bit hard to find. That's close. We can use that uh, if we don't find it anywhere. Where was this one? Uh, 3B. I, got, I like this coordinate system. I should probably start using it more often. 3B. Hmm. Is this a good time to mention that I've got really bad vision? I still find the shapes, but yeah. Uh, there's probably, uh, like for every one I find, there's probably like six that I miss. Uh, that's close. There's a circle instead of a square on the top right. Uh, I'm definitely not seeing it. And my stomach is starting to growl. I haven't had any food yet today. Okay. You know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna do this. Um, We might not actually get eight belts if we do this, because um, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to cut some stuff out here. We're gonna have to use the uh, well. We'll see how we go. We'll start off with the corners template, but yeah, they're. Uh, I'm actually not sure how much of this stuff I need. Yeah, I see. Okay. All right. I see how it's going to have to be here. So what we do is we actually start using the trash here. Now this is going to output half. So technically we need two of these. Uh, so we could actually get eight belts still. We just got to do two of these setups. Okay. So we trash this and then we send you over to there. And also over to there. Um, and then we rotate you that way. Okay, yeah. So that's... We got a little bit of garbage there. The rest of it should be fine though. Boom. Oh, damn it. Only select the middle bit. Okay. Boom. 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 F, copy that, and then what we're going to do is we're going to copy this entire thing again, because this is only going to have four belts of throughput for this one, um, because obviously we're throwing half of the shape away. So you can see the is definitely not full, but we have another setup over here and it's fine. So let's paint it red, fluid pickup. Yeah, now that I'm using these blueprints, it's a lot easier to sort of get this stuff done. Get these colors done. Okay. It still worries me that... Uh, okay, where are you going over? So you go over to there, and then you go over to there. And we already hooked up this stacker, so... That should be that should be that shape taken care of. Okay, this one's finally going through. My God, that took forever. This one we set up. This one, I would expect this one to be the next cab off the rank, to be honest. Yeah, okay. We got a train on the way. A little hint, if you want to follow the train, if the train is going too fast, you zoom out. If the train is going too slow, you zoom in. And you can kind of get an, a little bit of a... Um, you can sort of follow it and then sort of... It's actually funny because I used to do this and you used to be able to see it really quick, clearly. Now the icon that shows up on the map actually sort of blocks the second carriage. So it's a bit harder to see how many of the carriages are full. Man, yeah. 
that would be nice if you could sort of, the map would sort of show you um, how many of the carriages are full. But then again, if you've got multiple carriages with multiple levels, you can't obviously put all of that on the map, which is fine. So anyway, that one's going to go through. That one's about to go through. Uh, we're already done 1620. And we've got two of these. So we can start, um, I wouldn't say ripping this down, but looking at the next task, because all the other three are taken care of. And we're at 15 minutes, so we're, we're actually burning through these. Okay, so we need the bottom right. Okay, here's where things get a little bit annoying. So this is the bottom right. Uh, so let's make it the bottom right. Oh, that's just straight. Uh, it's just a straight shot. Oh, God damn it. Little hint, just click right in front of it and the game will automatically fix the belt uh, to the proper orientation. We're going to need a circle at the bottom right as well. Where are my circles at? Uh, I'll put it here and delete that. So we, remember we have to color each level separately we learned that that was a very hard lesson that we had to learn you can't just send a two stack thing in there and it just colors it automatically you have to color each thing i probably should have known that i really really should have known that but anyway okay so we got a painter uh let's go over there and then we got some fluid pickup actually gonna flip this uh, it goes over the other direction, who cares? And then, so the bottom left, so we send it off to the side. And we send it up here. And this is the bottom left circle, the circle on the bottom left, which is the right side, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's the right side. And then we just need us. So that was... Oh, we're sending in the square. Whoops. I forgot we are sending in the square. This is the square. The square is getting colored. Yes, the square is getting colored. So now we need to color the circle. Uh, let's just copy this design again. Let's put it right there. So that is this one. Going there. And then this is the circle for the bottom right. So we send it over to there and then we send it over to there. Now again, these ones don't matter too much. So what we do is we're gonna wait for this train to go actually go back a little bit. Uh, and then we're gonna remove that line, send that down to there, send that up to there. And then our third layer goes up goes right over there okay there we go and get rid of that crap get rid of that crap i mean now that we've got a train vortex input it doesn't really matter because you're not going to stall the station on the other side you'll still stall this station a little bit but the one on the other side you don't have to worry about too much okay and then this one green will come in so you're done, you're done, you're done. You're actually almost ready to pop. So what's the difference over here? Uh, oh, it's that's a little bit complicated. So we've got to add a red opposite and another red opposite. I think I know how to do that without too much pain. But yeah, we're overloading the hell out of this thing. Uh, we're definitely overloading the hell out of this thing. Okay. So. Actually, I'll put it there. So we got uh, move, using as little space as possible. Now this time, we're going to have to redo these. Because before we were cutting out just the curved bits. Now we actually want to cut out... the spiky bits and then what do we want for the next one 
What do we want? We kind of want one of each, don't we? We want... Oh, where's my task? Yeah, we want some at the other side and then some at the other side. So it doesn't really matter because we're going to be doing some rotating. Let's just do it like that. Yep. Copy. Finished off another task. Oh, that's the, that's the one that we're replacing right now. Okay, that's beautiful. So, F. So this is going to be rotating it a little bit. And then what we do is we do this. And this is rotating it by 90. And so we want this one to not be rotating it by 90. Okay, so now we've got one of each kind going through there. And we need to color both of them. Both of them need to be colored red. So let's set that up. Let's set that up. And we need a color there. And we'll actually reverse it and have a color there. So you go over to here. And yes, the spaghetti is starting to get very, very strong with all of these tasks. But I'm not fussed. So you go over to here. I probably should have reversed this train, but whatever. I don't like this. It leaves this little bit there, but you can't actually delete this. So you have to sort of delete the middle one and then pop it out there again. Now, these ones, we should just be able to stack them in any order because... Was this producing again? Yeah, we just stack it in any order. Okay, this one's done. Nice, we'll go into that one next. So what we do is we just have a basic, but we've got a stack. No, hold on a sec. We want this base, we want this one to always be the base. The, the one that coming from there always needs to be the base. So, that, but these two, these two coming here, we can just stack in any order. So we send that through there and then down there. And then this one, we send that through. Man, imagine doing this in, uh, with, without the 0 0.08 patch, which uh, auto put bridges. If this, if this wasn't auto putting bridges in here, this run would be a nightmare. As it, well, it would, it would be a nightmare, but it would be a hell of a lot less spaghetti on the map. So, okay. Why are you not dropping anything off here yet? Did I... I think I moved the train onto another line by accident. I, I lost the train. I sent the train off into the wilderness and it got lost and it never came back. Okay. Yeah. So this one is... Theoretically, this one is good. Okay, now we just need the blue one. We're currently making this blue. We just need uh, two circles and a W. That would be nice. I mean, we could just do it here. That requires, that actually requires a fair bit of um, fiddling around because you got to remove one quarter but leave the other three intact. That's, uh, that is doable but it requires a little corners set up here we will have to add i love how useful this corners set up we're using it so much these days okay so what do we need that's actually not great uh i'm gonna pre-rotate these a little bit um rotate right and see what happens because yeah we end up with this now what am i saying that did work oh and it only works after after i put the rotator then suddenly this pops up before this was in a weird state um okay so this one goes all the way through this one gets rotated then cut 
then rotate it again. And there we go. That's how we do it. Boom, boom, boom. We are heading towards the 50. The 50, uh, the 50 research points. We're, we're doing a very good job of getting there, actually. Okay. That's that shape. So we've got eight belts of that shape coming out now. Should be, anyway. Yeah, okay. That's very nice. And then we just need to stack it. Uh, stack, 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 stack. Uh, this one needs to be the bottom. And I've got to remember to reload that train because we just set that train off. Well, we don't need two of these anymore. We definitely only need one. Okay, you go over there, over there, and then up there. Oh, I might actually have two trains there. So it's the blue, and then we're putting the thing on top of it. Make sure that this is the correct orientation. It looks like it. Okay, so that one's done, that one's done, that one's done, that one's finishing off. Uh, let's go sanity check. It's been a while since I looked at this shape, and this is the one that gave me problems last time. So let's sanity check, make sure it's going correctly. So the bottom right, we got the square. We got the, there's no circle in the moment, but we have are creating the shape correctly. Uh, see, so yeah, what do we got going over here? We got the green, we got the red. This is looking correct. Yes, it is. And then, yeah. Then we got the blue. Uh, if anybody suffers from vertigo, from me zooming in and out really, really fast, I apologize, but yeah, I mean, let's let's be honest. It's uh, it's it's gonna keep happening. Um, it's interesting. Maybe once we made up all the quarters, um, it's possible that we could have put a them together layer by layer instead of putting them together quarter by quarter maybe that would have been simpler but it's kind of a moot point okay so that one's good that one we just checked on five seconds ago this one i'm pretty sure we're good we're just going to have to wait for it i'm not going to go and do any additional tasks um i think i'm done with tasks for the moment uh this episode may just be a really short one to be honest it may not be an hour long because I just want to get through. Uh, so you are there. Okay, that's beautiful. That's exactly what we expect. And yeah. So that's good. That's good. That's good. We're just waiting for them to go through. So this one, how many points are we going to get? So this one's going to give us 12. And then we just need two, these two to go through. And then we've got enough for the 50. So yeah, uh, yeah, it's uh, pretty interesting. Uh, I'm getting distracted. I'm reading messages from work on the other monitor. Multiple monitors are great, but yeah, I don't really know what to do. Um, I could I could start working on the next milestone. I don't want to though. Because I don't want to work on the next milestone because I'm just going to have to redo a bunch of it. Well, not redo a bunch of it. We'll try and... We can still do the general outline of it. Um, but yeah. Let's go scouting, actually. Okay, that's a bunch of points. I'm very happy with those. Let's go and do a bit of scouting because uh, we'll plan for the next milestone. So what do we need? Square, star, and circle. So the main pain for this shape is actually going to be the coloring. Um, but that's not really a pain, to be honest. Um, that's very easy. So there's no way we're going to find these shapes. I mean, we could find this shape naturally, circle and two squares. And maybe I should search for that one. Uh, yeah, because double star, that's easy. Single star, that's easy. So circle and two squares. That would make our life a little bit easier. So if, if we can find that, just... What? Are you kidding me? That was very quick. Um, yeah, circle and two squares. Do we have enough star inputs? Because we've got to be... 
aware of our sort of inputs. So we got two stars there. We got a bunch of stars over there. That's, that should be enough. That might actually, that's already the right color. So we wouldn't even need to do anything special. Color. And then we need a half. Is that half, half circle white? It is white. Okay, we're going to need a ton of colors. Um, so this area does look pretty good in terms of shapes. I've lost it. I've lost the, oh, here it is, here it is. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to take this, we're going to copy it, and we're going to place a milestone four marker right there. And we're going to move it a tiny bit because I hate having it over. Why are you not moving? Oh, you have to press the save button. I hate having it over the top of shapes and it just sort of blocks the shape out. It's not good. So yeah, we got this shape. We got the red spiky, which is a, a nice freebie. The rest of it is purple, um, pink or purple, depending on how you want to look at it, and white. So we need a fair bit of purple. Well, sort of. Fluid mixer. So purple is blue and red. We got a decent amount of blue and red. Green is actually the color we're lacking in this area. And we only need green for the white. So here it's white, here it's just gray. So we actually, we might as well start doing some stuff here just to sort of set it up because shape pickup. We're gonna to need to corner this guy. Might as well keep going. Um, yeah, we'll get we'll get at least the first bit of these done because I really don't want to sort of end the video at the half hour mark. Um, I just don't like the idea of doing that. Okay, train fluid. F. Well, uh, actually, what we're going to do is we're going to do F. Do that. Keep it nice and tight. Uh, and then this train line goes up here and over to there. And we've got to do the corners for this one. So we want to eliminate all, we've got to eliminate the top left one. So that means this one just goes through. Uh, and then this one needs to be at the bottom left. Okay. Now, I'm gonna just, I mean, we do need to do eight eventually, but we're gonna have to, yeah, we might as well just do eight now. Uh, and then we will refresh this later on because at the next step, we need to like split it up and color it. And so that'll probably be another setup over here, except one will be a corner. There was a red corner already somewhere. Yeah, it's right there. Whatever. We're not going to do that because we'd have to get the red corner. We'd have to take it together three times or something like that. So we're painting this shape. Uh... Six, uh, let's go ahead and drag this back to the hub. D, there we go. Drag it back to the hub. Where's, where's my belt? Okay, we can just, Ooh, it's a bit scary, sort of. I'm going to use a separate train line because I don't want to sort of attach it to another train line because that train line is, well, it's a task train line, so I might end up deleting it later. So I'd like to have it have it have its own thing. Um, be nice if this shape was I mean this shape we could make from anywhere. Because this one is going to get totally destroyed by the end. So it doesn't matter where we make this one. What is going on here? Alright, you're good. You're definitely good. You have been finished. We completed you. You don't need to exist anymore. Uh, 
yeah, we can we can tear this one down completely. Uh, yes. Say, give us back some platform points. Not that we're running out of them. You are taking a little bit of time to get on board. This one. And that's a long ass line. I mean, yeah, fair enough. That's a long ass line, but still. Okay, this shape is correct. Is it really just the trains are taking ages to get there? No, they should be there by now. I have a feeling those trains are lost. Those trains have gone. They've just gone into the into the void. They're never coming back. They're trapped on some other line. This is the annoying thing about trains. If you don't know, if you sort of make little mistakes here and there, and you end up with trains going under another line and just get getting lost in the void for like the next 10 years and you just have no idea what's going on. Okay, what do we got going on here? This one should have, all right, you're good. That looks like a correct shape. That does look like the correct shape. Uh, we haven't ticked any up though, which makes me a little bit worried. So we have a look at this shape. I mean, copy that. And then we have a look at this task. So we, what we do is, is it a little bit of a, so we look at this. I didn't see any changes when I copied that. That's not the greatest way to do it anyway, but yeah. I'm going to give that one a little bit more. I feel like that one might be okay. Uh, this one's almost finished. Another one going off here. This one is heading in. So we still got a little bit more time. Let's, let's concentrate on this. All right, so we got this one. That's a nice little thing that we can do. Shape pickup. Uh, let's rotate that one a little bit. So we've got to rotate that one to the right and then we got to paint it blue uh, train fluid all right let's get some blue color around here somewhere there we go there's some blue down here you definitely do start to see things from a uh, like normally this would be a massive distance when you're dealing with stuff you just say oh that's a massive distance i want to sort of look for a shape in a better position or something like that. So we don't have to go quite so far. And that's if you're using space belts. But once we're using trains for everything, that distance is just relatively tiny for sending a train over. We don't even think about it. Okay, now we need a half circle. Uh, I'm not, oh, there is actually a half circle just down there. I was about to say I'm not going to bother looking for a half circle, but when there's one right there, don't want to rotate it, just want to stack it. And then stack, 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 train stacker. Uh, maybe I should start using the tab button a bit more. So the bottom is this blue one. So we definitely send that one over there. Uh, the half circle. Oh, we do need to rotate this, whoops. I forgot that we needed to rotate this. Uh, left. Yes, we need to rotate it left. Let's just double check. There's this rotation. Okay, so this one's picking up. That's a good sign. This one just picked up as well. So all three have been picked up. So there we go. Once you've been picked up once, you know that there is no error with the thing that you have built, which is really nice. Okay, so this should be good. So we're going to send this one uh, over to there. And that is heading into the hub. Okay. Oh, now it's starting to get complicated. How close are we? We're, we're 50, 50 research points. I mean, I'm going to finish off all these tasks, obviously, but yeah, I really just want the third level. I mean, look, we're at 39 minutes into the video, so we've got time to finish off all of these tasks. Okay, so first things first, this green one, uh, we're going to disconnect this green one right here. 
we no longer send it over. And as soon as we disconnect it, we respawn the train. That simple. So now we got the top left. Um, and the top left one is actually going to go over here instead. Now we're not sending anything into the top left one yet. But the good thing about this is that... Uh, It's all just grays. We don't need to colorize it before we send anything over. Now, the bad news is we're no longer using circles. We're using, um, so we're using the thingamabob, this, this other one, which is annoying. We've got that over here. Okay. Oh, you're beautiful. You're done. Now we just need to colorize some random bits. We'll go back to that later. We're going to finish this. We're going to do this one first. And how are you doing? You just got another one. That's just changing some colors. It's like flipping the colors. That's extremely easy. Uh, let me not lose my train of thought. So, okay. Let's get some trains. Top right, bottom right, top left. Okay. We got some random things popping down. All right, so we need, for the final task, we're gonna to have to have all three layers and they're all gonna be colorized. So we might as well colorize these ones separately right now. So you are the top left, you are gray. So you don't need to be colorized at all. You can just go straight in there. Thank you very much. Um, and the circle is actually, oh, what am I doing? I was getting rid of the circle. We don't need to get rid of the circle. The circle is still there. Okay. For some reason I was getting rid of the circle. I don't know why. I thought maybe this one was skipping. I was getting confused by looking at another shape maybe. Uh, okay. You're finished off. So these two, we just need to do. So we still need the circle. Okay. Let me just go get the circle then. Uh, This is a circle. This is the top left. Top left circle. You go all the way up here. Where are you? This, this is such a huge build. This is way huger than it really should be. Now, I'm actually going to route you in through there and then there. There we go. And then so the W is right at the top and the final shape, the W is right at the top as well. Okay. Okay. All right. Actually, now, you know what? I don't like this line being here because it gets in the way of other things. Uh, let's just keep it on the outside. Let's just feed it in from the outside. Uh, F. There. I like that. Okay. Now what we do is we do this and then we turn that one off we read feed it to there and then we send this one down to there and for some reason it doesn't want to join up okay so we just rejoin that this one we go to respawn it cut that off respawn paste we just repaste it and then that one was going there i think yeah this green one we already cut that one off so we can just cut that one off don't need to respawn it because it's already there and then this one Okay. I'm pretty sure that works. Now the green one we did cut off because we don't need that corner. So we've got the bottom left, which is blue. That's going up to the top. We've got the top left, which is white, which I already routed on the same one that the green was on. And then we got the top right, which is going. Oh, so all the three trains are going up correctly. 
Uh, yeah. And these, these two bottom halves should be good for this one, should be good for this one. Getting good for this one, we just need the circle to show up, but that one's been routed. There it is. Ah, oh, we forgot to route the corner. I forgot to route this corner. Uh, that's a bit annoying. So top right is what we wanted. Uh, clear that out, clear that out. That train was going down to there. Clear that out. Clear that out. Okay. I don't think we created anything that got sent up over here yet. So yeah. So now all we need to do is we need to do this. And these guys have all got bad rotations on their corners. Uh, well, except for this one. This one is already correct, but yeah. Let's just copy and paste. So this is the top left over here. This is the bottom left over here. And then this is the bottom right. We just copy them over here. And then we select all of these and refresh them. And we probably have to respawn the trains because they currently got crap on them. And then this one is still, we cleared out the station, but it's all good. So now we need to do some colorizing with these guys and there's no red or blue close ish. So, I mean, let's just steal some red from over here. Uh, do, do check. Uh, do, 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 do. So we got some red color here. Red is the top right. So let's just color that. Uh, oh. Yep. So color thing thing color color thing. These are all on four, so I don't know why we're sending eight in there. But yeah, it's all good. It's all good. I mean when you only need like two thousand it really doesn't matter if you're doing four belts or eight belts. So this is the top right. The top right. So we send this over to there and then we hook it in. The top right red one, which we seem to have lost this train. We got a train there. We got the train there. We, oh, so the other ones are cool. We're just missing that one. Auto save. Thank you very much. Uh, we actually got enough for the third floor, but we're not going to do that. We're going to finish off these tasks. Next episode will be the third floor. Uh, okay, so you are the bottom left and you need blue. Mm, we'll, we'll, just, we'll just steal it from over here. Bottom left needs blue. Well, that's a train in the middle of nowhere. Not sure what that one was doing. Uh, no, that's the wrong line. We look hooked that up to the wrong one. Uh, go over to here. Bottom left, blue. Okay, so now we send this one off to the bottom left, which is right over here. Oh, we haven't knocked up the top left. The top left one should be easy because there's no coloring needed. So we just do it over here and then there. And now we just got the green one. And I might as well set up the green one because I know that we're going to need it. Uh, so let's just set it up. Mm. And then paint. And this is the bottom left. And then this goes to over here and over here. 
and up to there. And this shape then goes up to the top here. And what we're going to do is we're going to have this belt go up to here and then this belt coming into there. And that's all we need to do to do the last one of these is pretty easy. Okay, that is beautiful. Um, yeah. So we finished off that one. That one's almost done. We finished off the first one anyway. Now, this is basically the same thing. Uh, where is it? Where did I make it? Over here. It's basically the same thing as it needs to be purple. Uh, do we want to... I mean, let's finish off these tasks. Okay, we just need the final bit for these tasks. Let's finish this that off for this episode. We can get to the color mixing next episode. Uh, okay. So this one now needs to be green. Okay, that's easy enough. Uh, and these will be just kind of set and forget. So next episode, we may just be doing normal stuff. Uh, and set and forget, set and forget, set and forget. Um, I don't know why I keep saying set and forget, but yeah, we're going to be clearing these ones out. So we now change that to green. Okay, let's go over here. So this one, this level is now green. And it's as easy as that to change the color as well. That's really nice. I do not like this. I wish this would sort of automatically fill that one out. Uh, we got this one's green. This one needs to be blue. Send it over there. The rail length doesn't really matter because it's a task, so it's going to get deleted anyway. Uh, I clear all those out. Probably just didn't need to clear the shapes out, but yeah. You would be surprised how much... We're just actually going to delete everything. And then, because yeah, this entire shape has changed. It's like changed a lot. So yeah, we're going to clear it out completely. And that's the, that should be the final shape. Blue. That one's garbage now. So let's double check. Uh, that's garbage. And get rid of that. So, we got this shape, which is now blue, that's correct, um, and we had to do an emergency rotate over here because I screwed it up, but that's fine, we're not going to change that. Green is this shape, which is right down the bottom, so that's fine, and then we got this other one over here, which is now green, so that's that shape, that shape should be done. Okay, let's have a look at this one, because this one's a little bit more interesting. Um... You got four layers and they're mostly red and gray. Then you got four layers. So the bottom and the third, the second from the top layer have got a little bit of green in them. Okay, so we gotta go and mess with this. All right. Okay. All right. So now we're gonna have to have some fun here. So. Get rid of all that, get rid of all that, get rid of all that, get rid of all that. Um, yeah, we have to clear those out. So let's go and get our corner set up. So this time we are once again um, removing one quarter of it. So we're removing the spiky from this guy, basically. Uh, so... You just get sent down. You go there. And then what shape do we actually want? We want that and we want that. Okay, so that we just removed the corner from that one. Uh, F. 
and we've aligned that one correctly. So that should be, yeah, that should be correct. Now, all we need to do is what we actually need to do. I'm just, I'm not going to use platforms that officially, to be honest. Um, rotate right, cut. And then rotate right and then cut. We could do all of this on one platform, but I'm just being lazy. Uh, and then rotate left. So that is, that is my guess. I'm just doing the uh, rotations in my head. Oh, beautiful. Got it. Um, so now we just need to color it. Fluid, train fluid. And we need some green, so let's get some green over here. Mm. Mm. And then we need to stack these two and we're actually going to remove this line, uh, respawn this. Stack, 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 stack. Uh, and it doesn't matter the order because we're not doing anything fancy for this one. And then this guy goes around here, goes back over there and goes up into there. So it's going to be, if we've lined all these up correctly, this should be the correct bottom shape that we're feeding into here. Now we just got to get this side done. So, I have a feeling we're going to be doing some more cutting over here. Yeah, this shape. Um, this shape over here. We need to, because right now we're just doing the full one. So we're going to have to do this. We have to send that one over there. Don't forget the locomotive. And we're going to have to do some cutting and cornering. And then we're going to have to, oh, that's tempting. That's, that's extremely tempting. Um, yeah, you know what? We're just going to use that because that's already pre-colored. So I don't have to run around getting green or anything like that. So yeah, I mean, it's a little bit of extra work in the blueprint, but let's just do it. Okay. So what do you need? Actually, I already know how to do you, because you are what these guys are doing. No, that's the circle. Oh, this one's getting the circle. Okay, I've got the wrong cornering. Uh, we want this. There we go. Now that one should be getting the things. Is that what we want? Oh, wait a sec. We don't need to do any of this crap. Uh, hopefully I haven't. Okay. I didn't need to get rid of this because we've got this full shape. This is actually the, this one down here. I don't know why I thought I need to pull apart because we're already pulling this one apart on the third level because we needed a gray one and a red one. Okay, so that's easy then. So this is the colored bit and we're stacking this on top of this to get this colored bit. So all we need to do is make this one, um, make this one green. I was way overthinking it. Okay, this is beautiful. Uh, train fluid. Don't even care about the orientation. Just get me some train fluid. Fluid pickup. Uh, do, 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 do. And then this one goes down into here and this one goes over to there and we should be good. We should be good. Uh, and just before the one hour mark. So I'm going to do, go and do some sanity checks on these remaining three tasks. Uh, yeah. And next time, next time we're not going to get going on milestone seven I, any further I don't think what we're going to be doing next time is 
uh, 12 belts. We're going to be doing 12 belts for everything. Uh, where are these colors going? Where are these shapes going? What is going on here? Oh, look at this mess. This is for one task. This is, this is a nightmare. Let's just look at this for a second and see all of the belts going all over the plate. Well, actually, there's no belts. All of the trains. Look at this train nightmare. This is incredible. It's beautiful. And this is actually one that I kind of, well, I laid out this. This is nicely laid out. If I hadn't laid out this and laid out these on each square, then it would have been a complete nightmare. But even so, I didn't really lay out the train tracks very nicely, so it kind of got a bit messy. Um, what do we got here? Top left looks correct. Top right looks correct. Um, bottom left looks correct. It's still got some garbage to push out. Um, that one, I can just see the very edge of it. So that next thing looks correct. So we just got to wait for this garbage to push out. So that's on the way. Yeah. I'm just going to wait for this particular one to empty out and then I'll clear the thing again. You haven't, that's the correct shape is just being slow. Okay. Uh, yeah. So I think we're good. I think we're good. Um, I'm just going to sanity check these last three tasks. We are on the last level for each of them, except for this one, but this one we know how to do. So this will be like, um, when it clicks over, we'll just have to spend like a minute fixing it. It's literally, literally, all we need to do is send this train track over there, send this train over to there, cut out the middle track, and then we're done. All right. Where were we? Where were we up here? Oh, it's not actually going through because it's just stalled because there's just so much crap on the belt. It's not being fed through yet. Okay, and now we have actual good shapes coming through, which is nice. And this is crap. Half-baked crap. This is good? All right, so it's good to go. Um... So let's finish off with that one. Sanity check the other ones. What are you doing? Are oh, you with this this shape? We'll probably keep that for the purple. Um, okay, you're green. And you're blue. That's nice. I like that. That one's good so far. We're just getting at the top, which is a green bottom and a gray top. And that's ever so far away ever so far away. And that shape is correct. I don't know what's going on with the trains. I didn't see any on the way over there. So what we're going to do is we're going to replace them and then respawn. Re okay, so these ones are respawning. You can tell because the little thing's going on. All right, so that one's good. Uh, let's just check this one. That's the last one that we need to do. Um, we got some green. Yep. I still got some crap on it. Uh, I'm actually going to clear this out. Clearing out some of the good colors, but clearing out a lot of the bad colors as well. Anyway, this green was coming in here, getting whacked on top of this. This is all crap. God, that is, that is just a terrible amount of crap. Uh, it's a terrible amount of crap. Terrible amount of crap. I have to wait till this unloads into the station to clear out that crap and then clear out that crap. You are crap as well. Okay, so we cleared out all the crap and that one was looking pretty good. Whoa, what's that dot? That's like a very close star or very close something or other. Uh, all crap. All crap. All crap. What do we got going on here? I feel like this was this was okay. I hopefully I didn't accidentally delete any of that stuff, but it looks good. It definitely looks good. All right, we're gonna call it here. I think where I'm pretty happy with what's going on so far. This is the maximum zoom, and we can barely see our base. So yeah, trains use 
stuff gets spread out spread out a lot when you start working with trains but yes next episode will be milestone one milestone two milestone three working on 12 belts so there'll be a lot of there'll be a lot of blueprint work next time um oh what else could i spend let me just see what else i could spend my research on uh i'll leave it for next episode we'll talk about it next episode all right thank you very much for watching i'll catch you guys later